What was your first uh, comic book that you ended up working on? That was Plain Jeans. That was Plain Jeans. Yeah, Plain okay. Jeans. So yeah. that was um, that was with Shelly. Shelly was yeah. the one who was talking to you about the the Minx line. Yeah. And then what was the the book after that? What was the, what was the uh, the next kind of foray into comics? Into comics. So Jane's in Love, which was um, book two, and then I did like a couple of like short um, little anthologies. Uh, I did Odd Duck, which was a, um, a graphic novel for little kids, like um, four to eight year yeah, olds. Yeah, four right? to eight year olds. Yeah, Eisner nominated. Woohoo! And um, uh, and then I did uh, Nate Powell, who uh, did the amazing March trilogy mm -hmm. um, with Representative John Lewis. Him and I did a hybrid novel called The Year of the Beasts that came out on Macmillan. And so the idea was that it was um, alternating chapters of prose and graphic novel, so you could read. Uh, you could read just the prose and you got one story or just the comics and you got an, one story. But if you read it together, you get the whole story. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so um, that was kind of an exciting. So I consider that a graphic novel, like in the true, in the true sense, sense of, of the word. Yeah, you literally know? Like, graphic yeah, and novel yeah, putting put it, it together. together. Yeah. Um, so that that came out. And then, um, and then you know, uh, did a, a couple of little short, like, anthology things. Like I, you know... Because I really wanted to go to the DCU, but I didn't know how. Yeah. And it's not like they had training programs then or, you know, talent searches or anything like that. So um, I just sort of kept saying, I want to come. <laughs> Please invite me. I want to come. Um, and uh, so Shelly did, uh, Christy Quinn and um, got me, uh, I did a Aquaman, uh, I'm not Aquaman, Green Lantern animated series um, one shot. And then um, Shelly uh, got me to do a, a valentine's day special with aquaman and mira just like a little 10 page story so um so those were dipping my toes into yeah that. once you're in you're all of a sudden yeah. you're now worked on aquaman and mira and yeah. those are, i mean that movie made over a billion dollars now it's a huge character yeah and, and uh then you're in comics you know yeah. once you're you've worked for the big two it's it's funny yeah. how just working for just one of the big two publishers really grows your fan base yeah even for a 10 page story i feel like yes but I feel like I really had a sense that even though I was doing graphic novels um, that uh, you know I felt that because I hadn't done a monthly comic book mm -hmm. that I was still I was very well known by my peers yeah. you know but not so much by like the sort of general oh. fan base. Mm -hmm.